Matthew, what are your thoughts on the Shelby Houlihan situation and do you believe and support her? Oh man. Um, I don't know where to start with that. Um, I mean, I guess the best place to start with that is absolutely. I support her. Um, I believe her. Um, and you know, I don't, I don't think it's a, um, a complete, um, secret that her and I didn't have a, a relationship in the past. So I, I know her really well. Um, I know the, the type of athlete, the type of individual she is. Um, this case, uh, her, her situation hits really close to home, probably more than anyone else on the team because of, because of our, our past relationship and um, me knowing about this case really well. Uh, truth be told, um, I could have been in, in, in the position that she was in. Uh, the burrito truck that she ate at um, was a place that I ate every single time with her. Uh, you know, we, her and I would always get the same carne asada burrito. And uh, the one time that she didn't, she was going over and watched, uh, you know, uh, The Bachelorette with the girls. And I ate dinner with a teammate. And uh, we both got tested the next morning. And, and that was that was the test that they found the contaminated meat. And uh, um, when when people ask about, you know, teammates or about other athletes about whether they're clean or dirty or whatever most of the time you know you could be like i feel comfortable confident or comfortable uh speaking that i believe that person or don't believe that person but at the end of the day none of us really go home with with those type of people or with with some of those teammates you know you don't live with them but with shelby i was there 24 7 I, I i know what she was putting in her body i know that um the vitamins that she was taking, I know, I know, um, I, I would have seen it because I, I was there literally 24 seven with her. Um, it's, it's an absolute, um, it, it's probably one of the saddest things I think, uh, that I had witnessed in the sport, um, that I've been a part of the sport for the last decade plus, um, because it, it's an innocent athlete that has to, um, serve a four year ban from the sport that she put everything into that she trusted. Um, and I mean, I stand behind her. I stand behind all my teammates, um, support and words. Um, unfortunately I don't write as well as Chris Derrick and, and everyone on my team. And, and it was hard to put in words on how this situation made me feel. Um, but there is no doubt in my mind that she is clean and that she's serving a ban for something that she, she shouldn't be, um, uh, guilty of. Thank you.